Skype provides you with a calling feature that allows you to call your Skype contact. Calls can also be made to landlines and mobiles through Skype for a limited period of time. And you can undertake uh, group chats, adding up to 25 contacts per call, so you can collaborate with your students and colleagues. Until now, we have seen how to install, create a new account. Now, let us see how the calling feature in Skype works. Click on the contact that you would like to call. Choose Call Skype from the drop down menu for call. Once you click on this, a new dialog box opens. This connects your call to your contact. You click on this option. Your message section opens. Here, you can type and chat with your contact. Here, this is the emoticon option. Emoticons can be used while chatting as well. Over here, we have various options like mute, add or send files and end call. When you click on end call, your call gets disconnected. Calls to mobile and landlines. Calls to mobiles and landlines need to be paid for. If your contact has added their phone number, right click on that particular contact. Click on the call option. Click on mobile. Your call gets connected to your contact. In the earlier video, we have seen how to call a contact individually. Now, let us see how to make group calls using Skype. Click on a contact. Click on add people at the top right corner of the page next to the call option. Here, you need to check the names that you want to add to the group call. Once this is done, Click on Add to Group. Now you can click on the call option and your call will get connected. Here you can see that your call is getting connected. Once this is done, the call between you and your contacts gets connected. You can use chat option and you can also send various files and chat with your contact. Click on end call.